This is the energy vibration reading for the Aquarian Sun, Moon, and Rising for the second week of um, November. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is wonderful. This is positive. Let's see what's coming out for you, Aquarians. This is the week of water and the zodiac energies of also water. So um, it is that some of you Aquarians are up to deal with the Cancers and the Scorpion in this week. So let's see what is coming out for you guys. So let's see for you Aquarians. Yes, we have the energy of the Cancer comes up and we have the Eight of Swords. You're not seeing a situation. Ten of um, some burdens and then a Tower energy, which is good. Um, justice comes for the Cancer, okay, the, the um, Cancer, whoever she is, the star of the energy comes out for you, which is your energy vibration, and that is really good. Okay, the outcomes in this week is that you're going to be learning to work with other people to bring up a, a strong foundation. You're going to be work learning to work with other people to bring a strong foundation in your life. Okay, because I did say that this week is that some of you are going to be really, really dealing with um, the Cancers and the Scorpion, and here they comes up. They could be coming up as. Uh, um, family members um, they could be coming up as family members but we are going to be seeing what is coming out now on Monday you have the energy of the Queen of Cups whoever this person is it could be a mother figure it could be a sister it could be a cousin whoever this person is um, she is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this person could be a mother or this person could also be a cousin a relative but she's older and she's wiser she's older and she is wiser okay um, some of you have um, some thoughts you have you're thinking about this person it could be a mother that you have missed it could be someone who have uh, really treated you well and there is some conflicting situation that is going on because you're thinking about this person um, the the ones is uh, um, the energy of uh, burden you feel as if you're burdened because of this person but it's no longer um, some of you could be just a uh, missing whenever you're missing someone you feel as if it's a burden okay but this is going to be ending because um, what is happening is that some of you are going to be working with this person it could be on the work floor um, you're seeing that this uh, um, what you weren't seeing clearly about a person and it's as if it was burdensome and that sort of a thing it's gonna come to an end because it's not really a, a bad person it's gonna come to an end it's not really a bad person to be honest it's really not really a bad person now the energy of the magician is here on Friday it's a very positive energy the energy of the magician is extremely positive because what is transpiring and what is happening the infinity um, wisdom is as if the magician is as if um, this lady is going to give you good ideas also it could be someone who is a psychic um, who is going to give you some really good ideas and show you a way out of your situation okay that's a major arcana this is good it can also be a Gemini that is coming in to also help you Gemini and the cancer are good you have to have three major arcana and this is so um, powerful um, Saturday is going to be a wonderful wonderful day for you Aquarians Saturday is going to be an extremely wonderful day for you Aquarians um, some of you are finally going to see the truth about someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and that is going to release you of your burdens and the energy of the star this is going to be good this is going to be wonderful now on Sunday some of you are dealing with um, someone between the ages of 25 and 45 this could be your partner who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius whatever is happening this is going to be blowing up whoever this man is um, this man is going to be removed and released out of your life once and for all so some of you were dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius between the ages of 25 and 45 whoever this person is and um, in the weekend um, or, or so or in the week it could happen for different people at different time in this week um, you're finally 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 going to get rid of this person okay 
I'm seeing this as the end of a marriage because the energy of um, I'm seeing yeah I'm really seeing this as the end of a marriage whatever is happening I'm seeing this as the end of a marriage for some of you okay where um, if you are married or in a relationship but it's a marriage the end of a marriage if you're in a relationship with an Aries Leo Sagittarius it's the end of a marriage okay it could be that your mom if your mom is a Pisces cancer or scorpion show you a situation and let you know of something that was happening and um, this um, whether it's a relationship or whether it was someone who was trying to block you in whatever way it's coming to an end alrighty let's go in and see what is happening um, what was um, happening because obviously you're working together with this person or this person is working together to show you something okay um, so let's see what's happening um, with you and this um, um, what a sign person this person was um, working I was trying to bring some challenges in your life whoever the person is it could be a past life um, family member or past life family situation that came in but she was trying to put some challenges and some blocks in your life she was trying to make some challenges and some blocks in your life the seven of ones whoever she is she was trying to make some blockage or bring some challenges or she could be also helping you to get rid of the challenges that you have been dealing with okay that could be also what is happening so let's see um, the eight of swords and the ten of ones what's that all about eight of swords and the ten of ones there is some sadness eight of swords and the ten of ones there is really some sadness and the sadness is with the challenges that you had to to um, face and deal with it's about the challenges that you had to face and deal with and she is showing you it's as if she she is seen as the situation and showing you what has been transpiring this is going to be good okay what is the ten of ones and the tower coming down because obviously you were going through some um, real sorrowful situation that was happening in your life there was some real cruelty ill-treatedness that was happening and the energy of the tower come and took it down now whoever and whatever that was playing behind it could be that some of you this man who is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius who is young has been the person who has been in that situation and you have took it down completely okay then we have the magician and the star a very successful ending um, that is coming in a very very successful ending that is coming in and this is good because um what is happening is that the magician and the star is bringing in um, success in your life and this is going to be very good because what is happening um, with the magician the magician is coming in to bring you and teach you could be a, someone who's a Gemini but it also is uh, the energy of uh, you having what it takes to make it in your life okay let's see what is happening with a star and the Prince of one the star and the Prince of one for a lot of you is that you were married um, or you were in a relationship with this person and you're deciding to end it okay Oh yeah so here we are now some of you were not aware that uh, oh this is okay this is a strange message I'm getting people um, some of you are going to be if you were in a relationship with someone who is a a Taurus Virgo uh, uh, yeah an Aries Leo or Sagittarius he could have been working with another man and what they're saying and don't judge me um, I'm just the messenger that you're gonna be finding out that your partner was in a relationship with another man and this is what it's going to be tearing down because it's as if whoever this lady is this um, Pisces cancer or scorpion she's going to be letting you know it's as if you're saying mom you know my husband blah 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 and she's gonna be saying you know something that uh, there is something really strange about that that thing and then it's as if the universe is going to show you that your husband is in another relationship with another man yeah that's that's kind of strange yes I don't 
but I got the message for someone out there so um whoever you are um yes um, if you had a feelings that a relationship between your husband and another man was not uh, and you some of you were not aware that your husband was having a bisexual relationship also it's gonna be coming out okay it's gonna be coming out um, it's as if you're gonna be seen there's a lot of sadness but it's as if you weren't seeing a situation and then it's as if your sister your girlfriend or someone or a psychic is gonna be coming in because this uh, this is the energy of uh, a Pisces cancer scorpion is going to let you know or via the dream time if your parents they're going to let you know that and these two for some of you is that um, your life um, has been going out of race and it has to do with these two men whoever this young man was working with that old person one is that they they could be eerie Sagittarius or whatever, but they were working this old man is a sick old man okay he's always coming up in the reverse if you knows and every week I um, if once I'm using a card deck I always um, shuffle them really shuffle them to show us the energy and he's always coming in up in the reverse this is someone over the age of 50 and it's really sick because he aligned this this man to really it's the thunders he aligned this man and there's a lot of sadness that these people have, have drawn in your life okay there is some sadness and regrets um either for you or this woman it could be your mom there's some sadness and regret um maybe your mom is realizing that she is sick um there is some challenges health challenges if your mom is a Pisces cancer or scorpion there is going to be some end challenges but she's going to get over it okay let's see what is coming out I know baby it's a thunder eh? it's my dog my son dog hey it's a thunder it's okay it's gonna be good okay so let's see what else is coming out you guys have to make a decision okay there is just so many things that is going on you guys really have to make a decision there's so much sadness so much sadness so much sorry that is going on you guys really 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 have to make a decision okay you guys really have to make a decision and who is ever is this man it could be your brother some of you could be finding out that your brother is having um, a same-sex relationship it's okay um, the energy of the six of ones is in the reverse because the tower whatever that was going on um, you have already decided that you're leaving the marriage or you're deciding to walk away from whatever the situation with this person because you're realizing that these two persons were working together you are letting it go you're moving away from it and I said letting it go and you're going on a new start so this is good um, a lot of you are going to be deciding um, whether it's work situation whatever the situation is that is happening you're going to be deciding you know something it doesn't really worth it it's not worth it I'm not going to sit in a situation that is not healthy okay let's see what the angels have for you guys what else is coming out for you guys they want me um, to bring you two energies um, in the past so a lot of luck is going to be coming out um, for you guys especially with a mother if you have a mother and she's not feeling well a lot of luck is going to be coming in it's as if um, with prayers and asking for help for her a lot of luck is going to be coming out the magician is going to be helping your mom or whoever is sick whether your mom your grandmother a friend whoever is sick she's gonna be well um, you know she's gonna be well she's gonna be okay now a message is going to be coming in um, for some of you and this message is about uh, um, to come in for the people um, who there's going to be transition the negative energies that you have been dealing with um, some of you could be receiving challenges um, from others and it makes you feel sad a cruel situation that has happened and what is going to be happening is that that is coming to an end that is going to come into an end so some wonderful positive messages is going to be coming in for you guys um, this is good wonderful positive message so luck a stroke of luck is going to be coming in for you guys let's see what the angel has for you guys you have balance number 29 I understand and embrace the opposite forces in life that brings 
about balances isn't this beautiful uh-huh mm-hmm this is beautiful mm. number eight is in this is some wonderful positive energies is here okay wonderful so I want to wish you guys a really positive positive um, uh, month a uh, week is the second week um, I'm gonna wish you guys some wonderful wonderful um, uh, in this week um, cross watch cross watch cross watch cross but I can't say it enough listen to also your Sun Moon horizon sign and cross watch namaste